thank you to Ty Walker for suggesting I do the MCU. This is episode three of Breaking Films Mathematically. If you haven't seen the first two, I discover the best film mathematically for a certain category. And today we're looking at the Marvel Cinematic Universe. This is where we rank the MCU from worst to best mathematically. Here's how it works. I've taken the IMDb rating, the Rotten Tomato score, Metacritic, and Letterboxd score for each MCU film and plugged them into my algorithm. Now this value that we come up with is weighted and with good reason. For instance, The Dark Knight has a 94% on Rotten Tomatoes with 345 reviews, and The Wrestler, a film that was released the same year, has a 98% with 230 reviews. Because The Dark Knight has 115 more reviews than The Wrestler, it is harder for it to maintain its incredibly high rating. So that does play a factor and is balanced in our equation. So here's the data when we plug everything in. From number 32, the worst MCU film, Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania, The Incredible Hulk, Thor, The Dark World, Eternals, Iron Man 2, Thor, Thor Love and Thunder, Iron Man 3, Captain America, The First Avenger, Ant-Man, Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings, Guardians of the Galaxy 3, Ant-Man and the Wasp, Black Widow, Black Panther Wakanda Forever, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, Avengers Age of Ultron, Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, Captain Marvel, Doctor Strange, Iron Man, Captain America Winter Soldier, Spider-Man Homecoming, The Avengers, Spider-Man Far From Home, Captain America Civil War, Thor Ragnarok, Guardians of the Galaxy, Avengers Infinity War, Black Panther, Spider-Man No Way Home, and mathematically the best MCU film is Avengers Endgame. The bottom films I understand being where they are, but Doctor Strange 2 and Captain Marvel being in the upper 50% is absolutely crazy to me. Both films I thought were dumpster fires. My personal ranking is much different than this, and I actually put it in the bottom of the description. But again, this is just the way the math works out, and mathematically, the best MCU film is Avengers Endgame. That's it.